motion of the earth and moon. How do we measure time? In hours, minutes and seconds. We can even measure it in weeks. Seven days make a week. We measure time in months with a calendar. You know, 12 months make a year. So, a year is also a unit of measuring time. So, you know the different units of measuring time. The easiest unit to understand is a day. We have day and then we have night and then we have day again. This goes on and on and on. You can count time in days. But do you know why we have days and nights? We have day and night because the earth is moving around itself. It is spinning round and round like a top. When the part of the earth that we are on faces the sun, we see the sun. We call that time day. When the part of the earth that we are on turns away from the sun, we cannot see the sun. Then we call it night. That is how we get day and night. It is because of the spinning of the earth. Half the people of the earth are always in daytime and the other half are in night time. We call this motion of the earth rotation. Do you know how we measure a year? A year is measured by the other motion of the earth. The earth follows an oval path around the sun. This motion of the earth around the sun is called a revolution. The time taken by the earth to complete one revolution around the sun is known as one year. So, that is how we get years. Days are dependent on the earth's rotation. Years are dependent on the earth's revolution. These are the two motions of the earth. The moon is a satellite of the earth. The moon moves around the earth too. The moon has no light of its own. We see the moon because it reflects the light of the sun. Look at the moon on different nights. Does it look the same? No, its shape seems to be changing. Now, understand that the moon is nice and round in shape, just like the earth. It definitely does not change its shape every day. So, why does it look different on different days? That is because the moon moves around the earth too. So, we see the part that is lit up by the sun. We do not see the part that is in darkness. Only half the moon faces us at any time. But what part of that can we see? We see the part that is lit up by the sun. We do not see the dark part.